Hi, it's me, Safe Hop Beaver Brox, the British Tech Guru. This is a charger from Timu, and it says here 2.1A for iPad, 1 amp for Android, 1 amp for others, 1 amp for others. Why there's a difference between others and Android, I do not know. And why, I don't know. Anyway, this is a Tamu thing. It's so hard to read these things because they're really tiny. And I can't read that with a naked eye. And it might look brilliant and big to you, but it's not to the naked eye and not to my 57-year-old eyes, nor my lady friend's 60-year-old eyes. Anyway, um, this thing keeps shutting down and the whole thing shuts down not just one socket but all of them and it's not really performing as it as we would wish it to so basically it's a piece of junk and yes you could argue that um, let's see if we can get this thing apart I think it comes apart here let me just check I have no idea how this thing comes apart, so we're going to have to find out. And let's just pause while the obnoxious music goes on. And the hillbilly cursing and loud music has gone. Um, I'm looking at this and I've been fiddling with it while we were on pause. And I cannot see an obvious, non-destructive way into this thing. All I can say is I can recommend not buying it. So I'm going to pause for a minute while I destructively try to get in. And welcome back. Uh, Mr. Hexor and I had a little conversation. And we decided that we were going to Hexor all the way along there and see what happened. Well, it happened, and we can now pull out a piece of blank PCB, very interesting, and there we go, that is the actual circuit. Now, what do we have here? This looks like an interesting little bit. Let's see what we have. Well, I've had a good look at it. And this little interesting little thing right there appears to be a glass fuse. Full marks, Tamu. Full marks. But why was it shutting off? And it has the transformer there. But for the life of me, I cannot see any thermal cutouts unless they're in these microelectronics here. And if there was a thermal cutout, surely it would be close to the transformer there. Um, it's and it's weird on all the the wiring. It doesn't seem to be more wiring than just wiring these two as a pair and these two as a pair. Uh, I, I just don't know what's going on there, but then the thing shut down and, uh, well, we we're going to throw it out anyway because it doesn't perform as required. And shutting down is no good whatsoever, but I'm very impressed by that, by that little fuse there. Um, especially given that this is mains powered, I'm not so impressed by the fact that both of the connectors, hot and cold connectors, are yellow. I don't, and are they, yeah, and they're the same. One of these connectors should be wider than the other so they go in the only one way round, but it seems to be, you, doesn't seem to matter to the Chinese. Uh, but anyway. That is what I recommend you do not bother with. And again, this is another stunning piece of crapology from Tamu. Uh, yes, you're right, you're right. It's not technology, it's crapology. 
Uh, very interesting. I'm sure Big Clive would uh, love to ex explore it and explain why it works and why it doesn't work and what and what not and so on and so forth. But for me, it's just interesting looking at it to see what's in there. And that's about it. And I'll see you in the next video.